Hello everyone, today I'm going to be filming a video about how I dye my hair, just this nice lavender, like, sleety color. And to start off, most of my permanent hair dyes require you to wash your hair before, so that is what I did. I washed my hair with the hottest water I could and clarifying shampoo just to get all of the product I had left in my hair and try to erase the leftover color I had because I didn't want it to overlap too much. So starting off, I started with the base of Titanium by Ion Brights. I planned on doing like a shadow root just to help blend my natural root in with the lavender. So you're going to see me going back and forth and slightly creating a darker shade to put on my roots. Now I'm going in with Arctic Fox Arctic Mist. Just going back into the bowls, adding it. Just want to make sure it's like a similar color, but like, a little darker for the other one and this is Periwinkle by Arctic Fox as well and I'm just gonna be mixing these together to create the desired shade you can go ahead and add some pink if you want more of a lavender shade or a lilac shade and then you can see I'm going back with the Arctic mix just to make the other shade a little lighter to create somewhat of a shadow root when I apply it to my head. And of course, the tissue test. So this was the next day when I washed my hair and you can see it's a lot smoother, a little lighter, and a lot of the color did come out, but there is still a few patchy pieces. And so now I'm just gonna put on some gloves and then part my hair. I have really thin hair, so I don't really find it useful to do the four sectionings and then I'm going to be starting out with the slightly darker root color and obviously I'm just going to be applying it to my root. So I'm just adding this to the root area to kind of help neutralize the tone of my natural hair and then somewhat kind of blend it into the rest of the dye that I'll be applying to the ends. So here's me just doing that nothing really too spectacular or crazy hard. And I don't part my hair too well, just apply it to my root area. And I'm just taking pieces of my hair and then massaging the hair dye into it. Once again, I do have really thin hair, so I feel like it's not too big of a deal that I'm not sectioning it. Also, I'm not a professional hairdresser, obviously, because my hair looks like a fucking mop. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Just slowly massaging this in. A lot of semi-permanent hair dyes are actually like a conditioning treatment. If you look at Arctic Fox directions, it does mention that you can leave this on for 45 minutes plus since it does have a lot of conditioning factors and stuff. And it does help leave your hair very shiny and soft after you do rinse. And it's really important to like massage the hair product into like your hair just so it has a lot of staying strength and you're not just like slopping it on because then it can become really patchy. So I believe I left this on for about an hour, maybe a little longer just because I wanted it to stay for a while. And then this is the final result. I believe I filmed this part like the day after and I did put a little curl in it. So thank you for watching and I hope you have a great day. Like and subscribe if you will. Thank you very much. Bye.